this particular question, we are given a sprinter. He is running on a circular path of radius r. So that means he needs to cover a total of 2 pi r to cover one lap. Her average speed is pi r during the first 30 seconds. So during the first 30 seconds, she covers pi r by 2. Then pi r by 2 in the next one minute. So again, in this second time period, she covers pi r by 2. Pi r by 4 during the next 2 minutes. So pi r by 4 into 2. So again, she covers pi r by 2. Pi r by 8 during the next 4 minutes. So again, she covers pi r by 2. So basically, in every time gap that is mentioned here, 30 seconds, 1 minute, 2 minutes, 4 minutes, she covers pi r by 2. So in one particular round, or rather, if we just look at the first round, how much time will she take? For the first part of the journey, half a minute, then second part, one minute, then two minutes, then four minutes. And the same pattern will continue. So what will happen in the second round? In the second round, it will be starting from double of four. So eight minutes, then 16, then 32, then 64. What will happen in the third round? In the third round, it will be starting from double of 64. So 128, then 256, then 512, then 1024. As you can see here, each individual value is getting multiplied 16 times when you go to the next round. What I'm trying to say is half is becoming 8. Half into 16 is 8. 8 is becoming 128. 8 into 16 is 128. Take up any value randomly. 32. 32 into 16 is 512. 4. 4 into 16 is 64. 1. 1 into 16 is 16. So the time taken in the nth round, in any round that you take, will be 16 times the time taken for the previous round. That is what our question was. And 16 is given to us in option C. Thank you.